السلام علیکم آئی ایم محمد مزمل بابر آئی ایم اسٹوڈنٹ آف اویونکس انجینئرنگ فرام سپیریئر یونیورسٹی لاہور مائی گروپ پارٹنر از محسن جلیل ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول گیو یو اے شارٹ انٹروڈکشن آف مائی فائنل ایئر پروجیکٹ ان اور فائنل ایئر پروجیکٹ وی ڈیڈ سافٹ ویئر امپلیمنٹیشن آف اے ایف ٹی ایکس ایئر کرافٹ ڈیٹا نیٹ ورک یوزنگ ایتھرنیٹ کمپلائنٹ کمپیوٹرس اٹ ورکس بائی شیئرنگ دی اویونکس ڈیٹا بٹوین ٹو کمپیوٹرس ویا ایتھرنیٹ by following the protocols of AFTX data network. To demonstrate the working of this project, we considered one laptop as a transmitting remote terminal and other as a receiving remote terminal. In order to transmit the avionics data, we developed two applications. For transmitting N, we developed an application of virtual multifunction control and display unit MCDU. For the receiving end, we developed an application of Flight Management Computer, FMC. The MCDU is designed to transmit 12 different parameters for flight path planning to FMC, where FMC receives the flight data and gives the packet information. Now, I will demonstrate the working of our project. Now, you can see the Virtual Multifunction Control and Display Unit app on the left side of the screen. and the flight management computer app on the right side of the screen first of all we will switch on the bus controller from the flight management computer app and then we will establish the connection between two apps by pressing the connect button on the multi function control and display unit app let's suppose if we have to fly from lahore to karachi then we will type in lahore and put it in front of parameter from by pressing the button beside it similarly we will now type in karachi which is our destination and put it in front of parameter 2 by pressing the button beside it now i am putting 018 as the flight number by following the similar steps we can fill all the given parameters but in order to quickly fill all the parameters and test the app We have bike button over here on clicking it all the parameters will be filled automatically with system supposed values in order to transmit the flight data to flight management computer app we have to simply click the okay button now let us move to the flight management computer app and monitor the data so here in order to monitor the recent flight data we will click the refresh button Now in the flight data tab you can see the data we transmitted from multi function control and display unit you can see that we have received the exactly same 12 parameters in the tab named monitor data we can see the packet information of the flight data received at the receiving remote terminal which is flight management computer in this case here you can see different parameters of transport layer network layer and data link layer In the SID tab we can check the system identification data which gave us information about the transmitting remote terminal from which this remote terminal is receiving the flight data like here in the first line we can see that this remote terminal is connected to multi function control and display unit in the end to cut the connection between these two remote terminals we can either click bus controller off button in the flight management computer app or by clicking the disconnect button from the multi function control and display unit app thank you so much gentlemen for your interest and attention